Hey, hey, Jakar Lewis here, and I am back to tell you how to ace the math portion of the T's test. So I know you are antsy and you are ready to pass this exam so you can get into nursing school and make it one step closer to your dream to become a nurse. So this video is gonna tell you everything that you need to know, all of the resources that you need to get to get the score that you need and bust the T's wide open. <laughs> All right, I got myself together. I got a little, uh, you know, in the previous clip, but I'm back. But not for real though. I know how important it is for you guys to pass the T's exam. So today we're gonna talk about everything that you guys need to be super successful. So the very first thing you wanna do, of course, is you want to head on over to Facebook and you want to join all of the T's groups that you can. There are tons of T's groups that have great resources that you guys can save and download for free. Um, they have live tutorials. I have a group as well that specifically focuses on the math portion of the T's test. And I have free worksheets you can download. Um, we have Jeopardy style reviews that we do we have zoom reviews that we do we have practice questions every day um it's an environment where you can interact with other people who have the same goal as you so people can express you know the same issues that they may be having because you're not alone in your struggle to get better at math you're not alone in your desire to pass the test and become a nurse and it's really a great environment to help you to feel better about getting started the second thing you need to do which you're kind of already doing is get a feel for youtube and you know who does what and who do you like in terms of instructional style? So even though I'm someone who is super popular with math and I feel like I'm the best one, um, there are always alternatives to everyone who is popular. Um, as an educator at heart, I understand that students have to work with instruct instructors who resonate with them more. So take your time and go through the people who are highly recommended and then you choose to work with whoever fits your learning style the best because all of us are really doing a great job to help you guys to become better, but you just want to ensure that whoever you choose, you know, based on your YouTube search, um, they fit within whatever score you need in your particular learning need. So be sure to search people for science, for English, for math, for reading, and I'll post um, a link below with recommendations that I have seen over the years as well for all four of the areas. The third thing that you need to do is find some great books that fit you and your learning style. So you guys will hear me say that a lot. Learning style is so important when choosing resources because you have to know what works for you. And of course, my top recommendation is going to be my T7 math workbook, which I designed with you in mind. And when I say with you in mind, you may be someone who's struggling with math, who, who has always had an issue with math and it just never stuck. And when I created the book, I wanted to keep everything as short and sweet and as simple and to the point as possible. And I was successful in doing that. And to date, we've helped thousands of students making one step close to their dream by knocking the math portion of the T's test out of the water. So everything you need to know for the math section is literally included in this book. We have example questions, practice questions, over 250 video tutorials included, but you want to find books that resonate with your learning style and something that actually works. That's so important. The fourth and most important thing that you really need to do just honestly, like it's me and you right now. So I'm being 100% honest and blunt. You got to practice. I know that people are always trying to take shortcuts and you on YouTube trying to figure out the best way to cram and do this and do that. But the reality is that I am an instructor and I've been doing this for a very long time. And anytime you take a shortcut to something that's a longer journey, that's going to come back to bite you in the end. So use the T's test as your opportunity to learn yourself. What works for you? What type of learning you are? What resources do you prefer? Because it's going to come up again in nursing school and you cannot cheat and beat the system because somewhere along the line it's going to show up and it's going to show that you aren't competent. You don't have the skills because you haven't practiced. So take the time and learn yourself. Practice. Do practice questions. Do practice tests. You know, take time to watch videos. Just invest in yourself. Take this time time to become better. The fifth thing you need to do is create a schedule. So you have to have some type of consistency when you're practicing so that mentally you can be in the space to actually bring in information. So I know you guys have work and you have kids. Some of you guys are still finishing up prerequisites. You have your spouses or your significant others. Like I get it. I know that it's a lot going on, but you know now that the sacrifice that's going to be required for nursing school is extremely great. And you want to start to condition yourself for it. Now feel it. Like 
manifest it. Put yourself in that space so you can create the schedule. You can make the time for yourself because this is your time to get in a groove, to get in a space. So be consistent. People always ask, how much should I study? It just depends on you and what's available. At least if you can do three or four days a week. I mean, as a teacher, I would say five or six, but minimum three or four days a week, a couple hours to review everything. You'll be good to go, but it has to be consistent and it needs to be intentional. So make the time to study. Those are definitely my top five things that are proven to give you an amazing score on the math portion of your TEAS exam. So just as a recap, the first thing you need to do is head on over to Facebook. Every TEAS group that you see, not the fraudulent ones that's trying to scam you, watch out for those. But join the groups, so you can get the free resources, you can check out those um, live tutorials and things like that. Be sure to join my group, I'll leave the link um, below for you guys. Um, YouTube, of course, you wanna find an instructor that resonates with your learning style so that you can better retain information um the third thing you want to do is you want to find a book or books that work and that have been proven to work so that you can get the score that you need um the fourth thing you want to do is you need to practice you cannot bypass the hard work you have to put in the work and the fifth and final thing you need to do is you need to create a schedule you have to be consistent manifest that nursing schedule into your life put yourself into that space where you're too busy to be bothered and you're focused on the goal at hand Thank you guys so much for tuning into my video. I really hope that I was able to give you guys some better insight as to how to ace the math portion of the TEAS exam. A lot of it really just starts in your mind, align that with the intention and the proper resources and you will be good to go. So even though it seems like it's a lot, it's really not that bad. Um, I'll link my other video for you guys so you'll know the specifics as to which to focus on in terms of the actual math content. And of course, be sure to grab my top rated workbook. And I'm not saying that just because I wrote it, I'm saying that because I know it actually works. And from a really, a truly, like I'm really an educator first at heart. I wanted to make sure that you guys had something that works and that that you guys can actually use and it's simple and it's easy to remember so be sure to grab your copy many blessings to you guys on your journey to nursing um it's going to be long and it's going to be hard and it's going to be stressful but i promise you it's so 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 worth it in the end i'll see you guys next time